Alright, so, um, I'm actually just waiting for the game to update, so I thought I may as well go over what's new with the current updates. As you can see here, Fortnite saved the world home base status report 12-15-2020. And basically, let's see, Winterfest season concludes on January 24, so complete your frosty objectives and grab those heroes and weapons before then. So, I guess it's kind of saying that all the winter and Christmas themed stuff is going to be gone on January 24th at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. But let's see what we have. This week, Misfit Toys are on the loose. This quest line again. Uh, something isn't right for the toys that are home based heroes are opening this year. Abandoned Misfits. I'm not. Why am I reading this so fast? Uh, despite that, uh, December 18 at 7 p.m. Eastern Time, you will be able to unlock. Uh, jelly teacup from the Misfit Toys quest line. We also have Superheated Frost Knight Challenge heats up the burner. Starting on December 18th at 7 p.m. Eastern Time, the burner is heating up, keeping yourself and structures at a safe distance or feel the intensity of the burner. Alright, so I actually don't think I know this. Okay, I'm actually going to have to try that at least once. Uh, complete this Toasty Frost Knight Challenge to unlock the Ginger Blaster Pistol, and a unique banner. I guess by unique banner they're, sp they're talking about this one. Uh, it's actually kind of sick. As for the Ginger Blaster though, it's actually, I'm gonna have to say it's one of my favorite pistols of all time. I guess just because of the, uh, healing gumdrop thing from eliminating enemies. Moving on, we also have... The uh, Pain Train, one of my favorite weapons of all time, available in the event store at December 18, 7 p.m. Eastern Time. I mean, I, I love this weapon so much I have two of them. And that's probably a problem. I have energy and water. I'm thinking about buying a third one. <laughs> Comment down below if you think that's a good idea. Uh, Season's greeting with free llamas. Be sure to check the llama store daily beginning on December... 18th at 7 p.m. Eastern Time through January 1st. An extra special llama will be available from December 23rd to through December 26th. You never know what free goodies may appear. Hmm. I mean, free llamas may as well get them. At least I'm willing to log in at whatever time to get them. Week 2, the Special Delivery Frost Night Challenge returns. Starting on December 25 at 7 p.m. Eastern Time, the blue glow is tapped and isn't found in the environment. Venture out and defend the newly deployed blue glow dispensers that keep the burner filled. Overcome the special Frost Knight challenge to unlock Ted and a unique banner. The banner is kind of cool, but Ted on the other hand, he is a cool hero, but I mean, I'm pretty sure you can research him with legendary flux and training manuals. Unless they're changing that because of this quest. You can see here is a uh, standard and commander perk. Uh, and of course, available from the event store d starting December 25 at 7 p.m. Eastern Time, we have the Santa's Little Helper. Now, uh, I would highly recommend everyone to go and pick up this launcher because it is one of the best, in my opinion. Uh... Moving on, week 3, top it off in this week's Frost Knight Challenge. Starting January 1st at 7pm Eastern Time, the storm's intensity increases. Reports from the new reports from Frost Knight show that the storm damage is ramped up and closing in faster than ever. Make sure you keep the burner filled to mitigate these effects. So, basically it's like Frost Knight, but the... Uh, but like everything is intensely increased, as in the storm and the uh, the storm's movement and its damage is just increased. So it'll move faster and it will damage you more. Overcome the top it off frost and challenge to unlock the tree of light and a unique banner. Here you can see the unique banner and the tree of light. It's definitely one of those kind of unique and really cool melees, especially with its uh, sixth perk of like. Every, it was it, wasn't it like every eight hits on a single target causes them to freeze or cause them to get stunned? 
Uh, regardless, it's, it's actually kind of cool. And what do we have here? Available from the event store starting January 1st at 7 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, Monks wants to play. Oh, Monks is the hero here. I, I was just thinking, does it not specify the name? It's like, it does. Monks is the name of this hero. Actually, hero I didn't buy. I don't recall why I didn't buy her. I don't know. I mean, looking at the uh, commander and standard perk now, it's definitely something that I could buy. Uh, week 4, bringing the final frost in this week's Frostnik challenge. Starting January 8th at 7pm Eastern Time, prepare for the final Frost Knight weekly challenge, Final Frost. This challenge combines mechanics from Frosty Turf, New Wave Holiday, Superheated, and Top It Off. Overcome the Final Frost challenge to unlock the Shark Attack Launcher and a unique banner. Here you can see the uh, banner, and he of course here you can see the shark attack. It's actually a kind of funny, unique launcher. I haven't really used it a ton because I never really leveled it up. But it's basically a launcher that shoots a shark head that has dynamite in its mouth. It's kind of interesting. And of course, what, uh, that is available on January 8th at 7pm Eastern Time from completing the Final Frost Frost Knight Challenge. Uh, and Cloak Shadow Returns. Uh, you can see a standard and commander perk here. During Shadow Stance, deal either 6 or 20 base damage uh, per second to nearby enemies, depending on, uh, wh depending on if he's your standard or commander. He will be available from the event store starting at January 8th at 7pm Eastern Time. And that is it for the uh, status report. Nothing uh, necessarily super new aside from the banners, I think. The free llamas also sound kind of cool. Uh, of course, uh, the the link for this will be in the description for those who want to check it out for themselves. If I kind of uh, sped over things too fast. Anyways, I'm out.